Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to another video. Just want to wish you guys a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. And I hope you're enjoying your holiday time with your loved ones. And uh, here to see you guys. So, cheers. A little drink here. But yeah, it's been about five and a half months since I posted up a video. Um, just want to share with you guys uh, a few figures that I've recently picked up. So... It's actually quite a few figures, and um, I'm going to start off with some Marvel Universe. And the first figure up is Rhino. Really feeling these new, bigger modes on these figures. Also picked up Cloak. Need to get Dagger, but I really don't want to spend $25 on the figure. Um, I know Hasbro had him for 10 but I was too slow to pick it up. Got A-Bomb. And Abomination. So... Those two. I got Mysterio. And I picked up Zero Gravity Iron Man. I think that's the Zero Gravity or yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Uh X Force Warpath. Baron Zemo. Got Electra. Really liking this figure a lot. Captain America. Um, let's see here, Grey Hulk. What else here? Got the X Force Wolverine. And finally, pulled the trigger on Bucky. Been needing this figure for quite some time to add to the collection, but finally decided to pick that one up. And I also picked up Old Man Logan. Now, a quick story about Old Man Logan. Um, when I bought him, it was during San Diego Comic Con, and when it came to my house, it came pretty quick, and my wife opened up the package since I wasn't here, and she checked my figure, uh, all my figures actually, to make sure they're legit, and when she opened it, she noticed that the bubble was actually coming off the card back. So she let me know, I talked to the guy who sold it to me, and he said a few choice words, I said a few choice words, and I got my money back, um, well, majority of my money back, but I also bought another one, because I wanted one sealed. And as you can see, I already got into the star case, and this one is pretty good. It's still bubble still attached to the card, and everything's legit with that. So I got two Old Man Logans, so get to keep one on card and open one up. Also picked up this five pack of uh, Classic Avengers. Really liking that. Really nice uh, looking figures right there. My wife picked this up for me. Uh, it's the two pack of uh, Mandarin and then. Silver Centurion, I can't speak, but it's Iron Man, whatever. So she got me that, and I do appreciate her doing that. And I also picked up the taco truck uh, from the Deadpool Core. So all the guys are here. Um, haven't even opened it yet. Definitely want to crack this open and display the figures and also display the taco truck. This is really cool packaging. So, really excited about adding that to the collection and then cracking that open. Alright guys, moving on. Got a few Marvel Legend figures I want to share with you. Uh, first one up is Crossbones from the Thunderbolt box set. So, got this off of eBay. Really nice looking figure. Um, and he also came with his uh, gallon gun, so really excited about that. Also picked up Deathlock. Planning on doing a custom with him, but still undecided if I'm going to do it or not. Uh, probably will, but I don't know yet. Also picked up uh, the new Wolverine from the Wolverine Legends line. Um, really nice figure. Also picked up uh, Marvel's Wrecker. So, please, Hasbro, I'm begging you. I, I know everybody else is begging you. Please release Bulldozer. I hope so we can complete a team. You know, I really want... Pictures that I've seen online and the figure itself, it just looks so freaking legit. It just looks so cool. But I also picked up um, Scarlet Spider because I'm a fan of Spider-Man and I'm sure everybody else is. I uh, got the um, Hawkeye figure, the new Hawkeye figure. I hope we get the other one, um, but don't know yet. I uh, also picked up uh, Jean Grey. Really cool looking figure. And I believe this is the last one of the wave is Black Panther. So, um, yeah. So, yeah. 
yeah, that's the whole wave. So, really excited about having all these figures and all these legends uh, to add to the collection. And we're gonna move on. So, oh wait, matter of fact, I forgot to I forgot about this guy, um, the movie style juggernaut. Um, I picked this up because it was such a great deal, and I couldn't really pass it up. I was planning on gonna do a custom with him, um, but I might do something else. I don't know. But yeah, uh, real. It was a pretty cool figure, I guess. But yeah, there, that's the last uh, legend that I picked up. So yeah, hold on. Let me get to the rest of the figures. All right, so shifting gears, let's get into some GI Joes. I uh, picked up a couple of these bad boys, Iron Grenadiers. So still trying to build these up. Also picked up um, a Shadow Tracker. Finally got a Shadow Tracker. Really excited about this. I've been waiting for perfect timing to pick this one up. It's, he's so expensive and um, finally got a good price on him. So really excited about picking that one up. Also picked up Zartan. And I picked up the Data Viper. Really cool looking figure. This is probably my favorite figure out of all the figures within the wave. Still got to get a couple more. Got the Ultimate Duke. So, there he is. And, let's see here. We got Firefly. This is the, I guess, Ultimate version of Firefly. And Ultimate Roadblock, which is a pretty cool looking figure, if I say so myself. And we have Ultimate Flint. Another cool looking figure. And Quinn. So, another cool looking figure. Got a couple other of these uh, dollar exclusive, dollar general exclusive um, G.I. Joe figures. Uh, the variants, Gray Duke and Green Snake Eyes. Got these actually from Dorkside Toys for a really cheap price. So, really cool looking figures right here. Um, and that's pretty much it on the G.I. Joe's. So, let's uh, get to the next uh, group of figures. Alright guys, so let's move on to some DC figures. I got some Batman Unlimited and some DC Unlimited figures. Uh, first one up is Vampire Batman. Really sick looking figure. I really like this one a lot. My wife actually picked this one up for me. So thank you, babe, for picking that up. Um, this really reminds me of that new... Um, Nightmare Batman off of the Infinite Crisis game. It's like League of Legends if you guys play computer games. But uh, definitely seen a little video on him on YouTube. So this definitely reminds me of him. And I'm really excited to finally actually pick this one up. Or my wife was actually able to pick that up for me. Also picked up Aquaman from the DC Unlimited line. So got the Dark Side. So... Really cool looking figure right there. Got the new Deathstroke figure. If you haven't played Batman uh, Origins, you definitely gotta check it out. That that game is so freaking awesome, um, especially when you fight Deathstroke. Got Joker from Arkham Asylum. So got this off of Dorkside Toys at a great price. And I also picked up the new Arkham Origins Batman. So there he is, really cool looking figure. This is actually the first time I actually get to get a, get a good look at him. So really sick looking figure right there. And we're gonna move on. So I think we're gonna move on to some turtles. So hold tight. Let me go get him real quick. All right, from the all right from the new series line, picked up cockroach terminator. Got that one. Also picked up the Rat King. Real cool looking figure right here. So got the Rat King. And picked up a few of these Mausers. Once again, really liking this new uh, turtle line. And as far as the classics goes, got Bebop. Gotta have Bebop. And also picked up Rocksteady. Now, I got a great deal on both of these figures at Toys R Us. Um, if you shop or if you collect, you definitely have to have 
a rewards card at Toys R Us. So, got my rewards and actually picked these up for five bucks since uh, got a few rewards that came in the mail. And I picked up Raphael and Donatello. So, I still need to get Mikey and Leo. Um, probably going to pick the, them up this week uh, when I head to go see family and uh, go check out the Toys R Us out there. So definitely going to pick those up and complete the collection on the classic line. So one last uh, few figures here. Uh, actually two uh, more figures and they're Transformers. So let me go grab them real quick since they're over there and um, finish up this video. Alright, so the last two figures that I have to share with you guys are Transformers and uh, from the new Transformer Generation line, I got Thundercracker. Really feeling these new figures, um, liking this a lot, even though it's a repaint um, um, from Starscream. Really feeling these uh, figures. And last but not least, yes, finally got Transformer Masterpiece Acid Storm. So really sick looking figure uh, like I said if you got rewards uh, definitely use them definitely uh, start if you don't definitely start because uh, this masterpiece figure cost what 75 bucks at Toys R Us and I got it for 15 so it pays to shop and also pays to uh, use those rewards at Toys R Us so really excited and really happy to add this to the collection can't wait to open this up and display it in my Detoff, Detoff, can't talk. Uh, whiskey's getting to me. But yeah, that's about it. Um, gonna close this up and uh, yeah. All right, guys. So like I said, I'm gonna close it up. Definitely wanna thank you guys for watching my video. I hope you guys enjoy your holidays and had a merry Christmas. And I hope you guys have a great New Year. And um, just uh, yeah, quite a few figures and. Uh, I'm going to be heading back overseas, so I don't know how many more of these videos I'm going to be able to push out until I get back. Um, but, like I said, thanks for watching, and keep collecting, guys. Here's to you.